Hello, this is Seamus McDonald, and welcome to update number two for the build of Scalp Sailboat number 459. Today is January 13, 2019, so Happy New Year. So what we're going to talk about today is uh, where we are. Where we are is we're prepping the hull planks and the uh, bulkheads for the next phase of the build. So the boat kit pieces are cut from 8 foot sheets of plywood and as the boat is 12 foot long many of these pieces have to be joined together. So this jointing process is called scarfing. Now the scamp kit uses a, a jigsaw puzzle like jointing system or scarfing system and this actually provides a very effective and quite a strong joint. So you can see here in this plank section you can see the outline of one of these puzzle joints so this one has already been joined together. So the important thing about joining these pieces together is that we get a flush and even joint. And the way we achieve that is by laying the plank out on a flat surface and in this case we just laid them out on the on the garage floor and then we need to apply an adequate clamping pressure to get this flush even joint so in our case we used two heavy concrete blocks stacked on top of each other on each joint and uh, that uh, has produced uh, quite a successful joint. So after we finish uh, joining all the pieces together and we're, we're complete with the jointing process, we need to pre-coat all these pieces. Um, and we're pre-coating them with uh, epoxy, epoxy resin, epoxy finish. So this will be the first of two coats of epoxy that all the pieces will receive. Um, they will receive their second coat after the the pieces are fixed in position. Um, when these, uh, this first coat of epoxy dries, we'll be going over all the pieces with our, our sander in order to uh, have a, a roughed up surface so that uh, the surface is pre-prepared for the second coat of epoxy that will be applied after the uh, pieces are fixed in place. Okay, so uh, here we've got uh, bulkhead number three for the boat. And the significant thing about bulkhead number three is that it has, it is fitted with two large hatches. And uh, the hatches are, are like this hatch here. So, so we need to go and cut openings in bulkhead number three so that the, this hatch can be fitted. So, We've gone ahead and we've, we've cut the opening. As you can see here, there's two openings because there's two hatches. And so what we need to do is to put in a, a plywood doubler, which uh, doubles the thickness of uh, material around the opening. And you can see here, we've got it all clamped in place and we've just uh, glued that in place uh, at the moment. So the, the, this doubler is required to strengthen the open, opening and also to provide enough backing material so that the, um, the hatches can be screwed in place. 